1. Pop-ups are dialogues that open upon a specific action. Here that action will be clicking of buttons. 2. These are the imports. The first one, from the future module, is so the same program runs in Python 3 and Python 2.7. Box layout is the class the root is based on. We also import pop-up class for the pop-up windows. The string property will hold string values that we can refer to from within the KV file. 3. These are two pop-up classes. In this example, the two pop-ups will allow the user to select one of the three choices for color and shape strings. Once the value is changed, its own function is called. Here, we only print what is the selected value. 4. The root class contains function for opening up either of the two pop-ups. 5. The app class is created and run. The title of the window is pop-ups. 6. In the KV file, the box layout orientation is vertical. It is composed of two buttons which when clicked will start the process to open the pop-ups. 7. The visual layout of the first pop-up is defined. Its size is 400 by 400 and is a grid layout with columns set as two. Each row will have a label and a radio button since it is based on a group checkbox. There are rows for the green and blue, not shown here, but included at Blogspot. 8. We do the same for the second pop-up. 9. This is the result for the second pop-up, which is opened by selecting the second button in the box layout. In the default behavior, clicking outside of the pop-up will dismiss it. 10. These are the printouts after selecting all the different options in turn. 11. You can find additional information including the source code at pythonmobile.blogspot.com.